Hey guys, so today I went to Blue Water Shopping Centre with my best friend Izzy and I will be linking her YouTube down below, it is this. So go and subscribe and check out her videos. So I went today with her and we spent the day shopping and having a bit of fun and I did get a few bits actually there. I didn't get that many though but let's just say I spent a bit of money. Um, so I'm going to give you a little haul of everything I got. So before I do, if you're new here and haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button, click thumbs up and press the little notification button to notify you every time I post for you. Now let's go. Okay, so I have a pile of things here. And um, I'm going to show you. And I'm going to try to do like shop by shop. So it may be a bit difficult because everything's just in like one pile now. So we're going to start with, I went to the entertainer with Izzy because Izzy does like fidgets and stuff and plus I did actually want to go have a look and um, not just for me but I wanted to see if there was anything like cousins and stuff but I did end up getting two things for myself and um, I got these magnetic rings because I've wanted to get them on Amazon but like they weren't very like like they weren't going to come as soon as I wanted them to so I got these oh, it's just I'm not the best thing best person at using them so it just falls off my fingers to be fair yeah so i don't i don't know they're glow in the dark apparently so i'm gonna see if they are um if they are that's actually really good and they were on special i can't remember how much they were though and then the next thing i got was a mini brand and i actually opened the mini brand unfortunately i was showing my friend earlier and i just completely it's just completely slipped my mind that i was filming a video today so i just opened it so i'm gonna show you what was in it so i got this menu thing of everything that's in here and i'm actually gonna cross them off i'm gonna be that person who crosses them off but let me get a pen so i got this massive checklist and it's double-sided double-sided yeah so we're gonna start i'm gonna start by showing you so i got this dum dums lollipops so this definitely wasn't worth the hype um before i continue um yeah, definitely not worth the hype at all. Um, then I got this bacon crumble things, and they're all American as well. It's gonna focus. It's the best I can get. Then I got gravy. Then I got almonds, lightly salted. Then I got this scanner thing that you just go. Like when you're in Ikea and you go to the self-serve and they go beep. So, I'm going to cross these off my checklist. Probably not even going to collect them, to be fair. So, we didn't get any gold or glow in the dark. But we did get... I don't think this is a metallic, you know. We're just going to cross off this anyways because we did get it. So, it's quite rare. It's a metallic. So, and then we got bacon bits. I want to smudge it, it's okay. I'm just casually looking here now for everything. Just so I can quickly cross it off. Everything here is common. Brown gravy, I got that. Strange thing is I can't seem to find these bacon. Actually, I think I just found it. Then I got to find this low almond thingy. It's going to be up here somewhere because these are the smear. It's here, I'm pretty sure. Low sodium. And then I got this yellow scanner thing, which is here. Yeah, I didn't get anything else with it. So that's everything I got from the entertainer. And yeah, I definitely don't like rate the mini brands. Like, I don't understand what all the hype was about with them. But I do understand why people do like them, maybe, because like you can collect them and stuff, and they probably are, if you sell them, you probably could get some money. So the next shampoo I'm going to show you is Havana's, so I'm going to show you what I got. This is the bag, it's not actually for me, it's for my mum. So my dad asked me to buy her some Havana's flip flops, because hers actually broke, and she used them literally all the time when she had them. So I'm going to show you, here are the Havana's. They're actually really cute and they are a 39 to 40, which is actually my shoe size. 
so if I want to borrow them, I'm sure she'd like them. They're really cute, they're like rose gold, and they're, the strap's really good. They are not exactly the same. I couldn't find the exact same ones, but I found some that are really similar. So that is literally the only one I got from Pavanas. They were quite expensive, they were £25, and for flip flops, that was quite expensive. Next shop. Okay, so the next shop is gonna be Super Drug. So I'm just gonna pull out the stuff that I got from there. It wasn't too much. Um, one, two, I got one more thing. Three. Okay. So the first thing I got is shower gel. I got this Radox Feel Energized and it's peppermint and key lime. I actually like the smell of this one. It smells really good and I've used this before and it's really good on my skin. It makes it feel really soft and really smooth. So this week and last week I managed to use one of these and it was the Feel Detox which is the pink one. But I've used the green one today. Then I got I got three foot packs, but I got one for Izzy, so I gave it to her when we dropped her home. So we got hemp seed oil for my mum, and then I got a honey and almond one because they are the best thing for my foot. So this is a foot nourishing. This is foot pampering. So this helps moisture the skin, and they both have vitamin E in them. And you just put them on for 20 minutes, and they're both 20 minutes. This, this is 15 to 20, and this is also 15 to 20, but they say 20 minute therapy, so. That's everything from Superdrug. So now I'm going to show you the next shop. Okay, so the next shop is WH Smith. So I'm just going to grab the couple of items I bought from there. When I say couple, I mean a few. There's like four things I'm pretty sure I bought. I didn't buy that many. Normally I buy quite a bit from WH Smith, but there wasn't that many. I that much I saw. So first thing I got, I actually got stuff that I actually needed, except for one thing. So the first thing I got was this rubber and sharpener. This is the sharpener. And then the rubber is quite a big rubber. And the rubber doesn't come out, which, is, oh, it does actually. But it's fine. It's definitely a bigger one, so it will last longer. But I think it's worth getting a bigger one because I've got exams and stuff coming up, so I know I'm going to need it. I don't know if I need a clear pencil case for my exams, actually. I need to ask. Just got to clip this in, but it's not going back on. All right, there we go. Okay. okay, so next thing I got was this ruler. Is this limited edition one? I'm going to show you. So you could get the blue and yellow one, which is what Izzy got. And I got the other one, which I think they should have done like yellow and pink and blue and green. So the one thing I don't like about Oxford rulers is they're really stiff when you first buy them. Like, and then, yeah. So it's this one and it's really nice i really like it and it doesn't really matter what color it is for me as long as it does its job as a ruler it's fine then i got a um and my one had snapped which is why i got a new one and then i got a blue hack which is just this massive one um i bought it because i did need it for something but now i actually can't remember what i needed it for so it's really annoying i think i wanted to stick up some notes in my room that's why i didn't want to stick it like make a revision wall somewhere and I just had to name it all. But yeah, so that is this. Then the last thing I got, it's kind of ridiculous. So I have this big pen. Is it in here? I don't know if it's in here. No, I don't know where I put it. Um, it's like a big pen topper for um, like a big pen, and it has big pens in it. And I use the big pen. So when I went to say, I saw this stabber though pen one i got the red one they had it in blue and um black i think and then it's just these fine liners and they're really good like i've used it already and i love them i you had these but mine broke so um i'm really excited to use these and yeah um this is definitely something i didn't need but i didn't call you so i guess i don't know but yeah i really like them so let's go on to the last shops and everything, of, actually no, not everything I bought is clothes, but most of it is clothes. Okay, so I'm going to show you the stationery stuff, like the last bit of stationery, which is from Typo. So there is a shop called Typo, most people I think have heard of it, but if you haven't, it's one of my favourite stationery shops. And it's actually got really reasonable stuff, like the notepads are really good pricings, and so the pens aren't the best pricing, but the um, notepads definitely are. So I got this notebook and it says 
where's my control z for real life because like control z means like to undo so like where's my undo for real life like how can you just undo stuff and then i got another notebook for one pound this was this was two pound fifty and this is a pound from 350 and it says deep thought about the universe universe yeah universe and it's got sections and stuff so i'm probably going to use this for revision for um, maybe science i don't know i really like it though and then i bought these tissues they go to charity apparently so i went and like normally you can buy stuff like cheaper out of the kill but then they said oh do you want these tissues all the money goes to uni stuff and i just felt so bad for, like if I said no because the money's going to charity, so you know what? I bought them, they're 50p and they're like good for the environment, they're bamboo and it says real good doing. Yeah, and I've actually bought stuff using the by cotton foundation, cotton, cotton on foundation before, so I think it's a really good purchase and all the money goes to charity, so I really like it. So let's go to the last two shops. I'm just going to put it all in one because it's all clothing. Okay, so first thing I got is this t-shirt. I bought it in a medium because they didn't have a small or an extra small. Um, so I bought it in a medium and I just wear it oversized. So it's quite oversized. So I just wear it as like a night shirt maybe. And it was £10 from H&M. And it says, I don't even know what it says. It says Pacific Sun Love. I don't know i thought it was really cute and i thought i could wear it cycling shorts or something because i do have a really cute pair so i got this from h&m and then i also got this from h&m it is by the h&m basics it's an extra small do i buy an extra small yeah i bought an extra small because all my spaghetti strap tops are an extra small because if they're small they fall they like just the straps fall and stuff so it's just this simple one it's really cute and these strapped strap tops like spaghetti ones are really comfortable so yeah i got this from h&m and then everything else is from primark so i got these pajama pajama bottoms pajama shorts they are a medium because i didn't have a small again and they are literally like fat they're like really soft and i don't think they'll keep me like hot they'll make me hot they won't i don't think and they're like got stars on them so cute and i don't have pockets unfortunately which is one thing i do like in shorts but you know what the softness makes up for it and this was um four pound and this was not four pound fifty um i don't know how much it was because it doesn't actually have the price tag right the barcode here is four pound fifteen euros i'm pretty sure it's four pounds four pounds and this is actually 2.99 i'm pretty sure from h&m yeah 2.99 and this was 4.50 or four pounds in 450 euros then i also got um this really nice oversized top they had loads of disney stuff so i just picked up that um it's really oversized and it says mickey mouse on the sleeves and then on the front it says we only have one home let's take care of it and it's like a kind of like a save your planet kind of vibe and it is really big this one really big and it's a i don't know what size it is it's a medium it's a small and this was 10 pound and i think it's worth it it's a really good material as well i like it then i also got this mickey top and i think this would go really cute with some cycling shorts or just black shorts this was also as small as you can see her and it was five pounds for primark again then i also got um these shorts these like corally ones and they go really cute with like my white spaghetti strap top and i have these in blue and they're so comfortable so i thought i'd get them in coral as well they had them in pink but i only wanted them in coral and then they were four pounds so yeah they didn't they just put, they put the irish price i'm pretty sure or the european price but we're in britain we're not in the eu anymore um so then i got this other oversized t-shirt this was massive this is literally a night dress on me and this is actually a medium which is why and it is um six pounds this was really cute though so it was worth it i'm pretty sure it's a nightshirt i can't actually remember where i got half of the stuff from then i got this mickey top i actually got matching with izzy 
so it's just this one and it says mickey 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 it doesn't say mickey mouse or anything and this was also six pounds really cute and it's massive then i got these black this has to be like the favorite thing i got of the day mm, actually yeah it is this black shorts and they have pockets and i have them in green and i have them in pink like sand color i think oh i put them in the wash i'm pretty sure i would shown you but i got them in black too because you can never go wrong with black like this works this just works so super cute and the last thing i got from this shopping trip today was flip-flops 90p best things i've basically i've had primark flip-flops longer than those havanas and the primark flip-flops have lasted longer but i didn't wear the primark flip-flops as much as the havanas my mum wore the havanas so maybe that's why so that is everything oh and i also did get lunch but it was like um nando's and then i got six a pack of six donuts to share so i got three three sprinkles three sprinkles an original a dream cake and and a lotus biscoff one so i'll just share those out and then my mum got millie's cookies so i had one of those earlier and izzy got a splendid and milkshake but you'll probably see that on her um channel which i will link down below and you guys can go check out the vlog where we were actually in blue water so that does bring us to the end of this week's video if you like waiting remember to hit the subscribe button click thumbs up and press the little notification bell to be notified every time i post a video i will be posting hopefully a lot more now but i may be a bit busy due to exams at the moment which starts on tuesday but i will try to see if i can film I may think of doing a day in the life of me doing exams. I am not day in the life, day of the week, in the weeks, every day in the week. I don't know yet. So hopefully I will be posting a bit more. And I do have a secret project coming up, which I will be revealing soon to you guys. No, it's not a collab with anybody. It's something I'm really excited happening. And it's something to do with my house. So yeah. Bye guys.